piece because we're uh, think fast so i got a, a download on a good analogy of like why you know source is everything so when we think to that vibe of like uh thinking like all oh, the illuminati killed tupac michael jackson these and that like now of course to a certain extent you know maybe some of these uh on a human level some of these people may have had something to do with these people transitioning but the bigger picture is that nothing happens by mistake and everything by reason and, and source that's so amazing and beautiful and powerful is not going to allow for some somebody to transition if it's not their time to transition but i caught a download so basically i caught a vision of me chilling with some other brethren uh who deal with the you know with the info who, who's basically in tune other brethren and sister actually you know uh like just fellow YouTubers and just other people who connections are very strong. And I thought to myself, I'm like, cool, boy. The atmosphere, like like all those beings that's around us, like, bro, that'd be like a, like I could imagine like all the energy, you know, in one room with all of us being on that vibe, you know? And as soon as I, I, I said it though, you know, it just uh can't, I flashed the, the vibe of the as above, so below, like where, well, for one, you know, us coming together, it has to be a time. There's a reason for everything. Reason why none of us are coming together and creating these groups and stuff like that because it's, now is not the time. This spiritual awakening is like the perfect dance, and nothing can move too slow or too fast. It has to be a balanced thing, you know. Maybe like at certain times, like Tupac and Michael Jackson, what they were putting out there, or the things they were dealing with was moving a little too fast for the for the uh the growth of the universe well you know but which they did they job they came in and did what they were so you know what i'm saying and then you know bam it was time for them to, to move around but i caught the as above so below aspect like say in your body right now if a few cells a few of the you know the the cells in your body that has some of the most alkaline vibrations in it you know what i'm saying they decide to to come together in one part of the body and be like, you know, and they start to tap into that. So say for instance, cause you know our body, you know, does start running on its own to a certain extent. Of course we got consciousness of, uh, you know, running certain parts, just like I'm constantly moving my arm, but then like I'm not consciously pumping my blood or telling a, a cell in my throat to deliver some information to my knee. I'm not really consciously doing that. It kind of has its own consciousness to do that. So with that being said, like, imagine if uh, a few cells that was, you know, their vibration was high, you know, and they get to a certain part of the body and they come together and they just kind of decide to want to, you know, really push along with this growth, like, and really get, you know, this alkalinity going in this area. But not realizing that, you know, they, they moving a little bit too fast. Like, what's best for the whole body is for this to go across the body, you know, equally and evenly. You know what I'm saying? At a certain pace. But these cells in my body, you know, they're going to end up making this reaction happen fast and it's going to throw things off. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, damn, I got to do something to eliminate those cells. You know, so since, you know, remember balance, because it's no good or bad. You know, alkalinity is, uh, you know, good to the place where it's taking us out of being very acidic, but it's about balance. So, uh, dang, how, how I was going to uh, say this? Yeah, so even though you know alkalinity you know uh, let's just say this that part of the body you know they alkaline it up this and that but that's not what's best for the whole body in the moment like so say for instance i would feel that hindering the you know my my full growth so i would take something say for instance something that would balance that out something a little more acidic say for instance you know what i'm saying so i might drink some coffee now and that coffee and those little vibrations of that coffee go to those high vibrational cells that have been congregated together and you know and it and it drops their vibration if it don't possibly eliminate them you know what i'm saying to just you know take care of that problem as a whole or you know just make sure no other cells get no ideas of their own and try to move this growth faster than it should go you know this is this is transit killing them but not killing them, but transition the physical aspect of these cells, you know, because they, they hindering the whole outcome, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, and this is one of, this is a channel straight up. So it's one of them, I'm not guessing or 
they, like this is what it is and this is what my source is telling me to share it, it, it may resonate with you it may not you don't have to accept it you know it is what it is the free will universe uh to the to the extent of uh you know free will and a balance of destiny is a paradox of both of those mixed together it is what it is but uh <laughs> just that whole aspect though of why you know certain beings coming together you know what i'm saying like a bunch of us uh you know bringing our light together the reason why it's not happening right now because it's just uh the, it would be pushing the process along in a, in a in a way that would throw off just the fullness of our evolution you know what i'm saying like there's things that have to be in place because again earth is growing at a certain pace earth may not be ready for say fest like nikola tesla with the vibes he was on maybe earth wasn't ready for those vibes in those times you know what i'm saying it, again it's a girl a girl we go through different things in different parts of our growth for certain reasons and you know our growth has a certain pace to it you know uh when we I always use the analogy too of like when you're moving a fish from out of a certain fish bowl and putting them into a new fish bowl you know before you put them into that new fish bowl you transition them to a certain water that that uh you know that 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 has that same vibe of the water you're gonna put them into to help them kind of like transition and not just like boop, throw them into the other water because they could you know shot and transition <laughs> so that's another thing too like uh just with with, with things because we we take this vibe of spirituality being from a place of we got to be the high vibrational part of god and source and that's it like we've been we we see it like we've been taught from a spiritual aspect, you know, or I should say more of a religious aspect that it is about being on one side, like it's about a good or a light. And it's like, nah, it's about balance, you know what I'm saying? And uh, certain beings bringing about too much light, you know what I'm saying, to where get, we gotta be grounded, you know what I'm saying? Like it, we in our physical nature, you know what I'm saying? We, so the moment somebody goes to try to push it too far out of, you know, like to where you're going to one side of the situation, you're not balancing out. That's another thing. So not only just the uh, safe fest is giving people information in essence that will throw off things too early, but also like uh, the vibe of raising the vibration to a point of being disconnected from the wholeness of being. You know what I'm saying? Like I look at my growth, for example, like where I was in my higher chakras, but then I barely was existing on the physical plane. And, and it was creating like a, uh, you know, some type of turmoil within myself because I, I am in a physical body as much as I want to be in the astral planes and I'm not a physical human and uh, yeah, of course all that's true, but I am in a human body right now and that's true. And in order to do things in this human body, I got to be of a certain vibration that's balanced. I can't, you know, it you can't be in way, and I say can, but it's just extremely difficult to. Uh, be in those higher vibes and raise yourself to a play like uh of course you could balance them out but it is difficult to raise the vibration extremely high while still being extremely grounded you know what i'm saying like you gotta have a little balance spot but that's just the whole thing like so on some as above so below vibes like you know for what's good for the wholeness of the body and the growth of the body as a whole some some cell matter of fact and it is a balance because on the flip side some cells moving too slow and that's why they transition and so the people who just don't want to grasp this information at all you know what i'm saying who like so so not a, so is a you see the balance in things if a person say for instance moving a little bit too fast or you know with certain information they may be put to a transition if a, and if a person moving too slow on their spiritual growth then they get put into a transition but a person that's in that balanced spot you know what i'm saying they they existence be balanced in this physical plane you know but again there's no right or wrong it's not to say that uh it's good or bad about transitioning or not being on this earthly plane till you're 80 years old 100 years like whatever time that you transition from your physical body in this existence was the perfect time you know no wrong or right way, no good or bad. Just keep 
keep that in mind constantly. But peace happened now. Now's the vibrate, of course. I'm not going too far in the future. 